My name is Evan, and I'm part of Ultimate Adventure, and I've been coming to this camp, or to camp since I was around six or seven. My favorite part of camp so far was the Vespers and the worship. They were really powerful and, and moving, and I just had a lot of really good moments. And this week I, I learned uh, how to keep a better relationship with God when like you make a milestone or Ebenezer and if you're going through the if you're going through a hard time you just think back to the Ebenezer and it'll help you you know keep going uh, our cabin was Palomino Point and we had Andrew as our counselor it was pretty awesome so this week I saw God through uh, nature especially when we had vespers at the lake there's an amazing sunset while singing a song about how beautiful the world is if I if I could would tell a friend about this camp I would tell him everything about how awesome the ropes courses are the canoeing the hiking the rock climbing you know the caving that was pretty awesome that was new it was, everything was awesome. My name is Catherine Witte and I'm a part of the Ultimate Adventure Camp. This is my sixth year at camp. Um, my favorite part of camp was doing devotions with my cabin because I, you really learn a lot during them and you just learn that God can work in so many different ways. An important decision I made this week at camp was to love myself for who I am and not for like what the world wants me to be. And I know that's something a lot of girls struggle with. So um, my counselor just taught me it was really important. So that's what, I was gonna, that's what I'm taking away from this week. I learned that even though God isn't always doing exactly what you want him to do, he's doing the best thing for you, even if you don't like it. My counselor was amazing. Um, I have been coming here for six years and I've had pretty amazing counselors, but she was definitely the best. So. And my cabin connected in like the 10 seconds we saw each other for when we pulled in on Sunday. It was a really great experience getting to know those amazing girls. Um, I saw God this week through my cabin and my counselor and the way that if we were having a hard time or if we were crying, we would all just put all together and comfort each other and we could talk it out for hours and hours. If I was telling a friend who didn't know anything about Camp Hebron, I would say that camp is life changing and it warms your heart the second you pull in to the Camp Hebron driveway. I'm definitely planning on coming back next year and hopefully I'll work here at some point. Uh, my name is David and this is my third year going to camp. My favorite camp experience were probably all the awesome adventures that we went on. Uh, we were part of Ultimate Adventure, and it was with our counselor, Andrew Yoder. And probably my favorite part was all the awesome adventures, but not only did you do that, you also grew with yourself and God. So when you were able to have fun during the day, you were able to be able to get serious at nighttime and be able to really focus on growing with God. I made a couple important decisions this week, mostly being able to communicate better with him and I'm going to try to focus more on this week because in this week you're focusing on God and trying to communicate with him but at home you really your focus is gone so I'm trying to be able to keep myself on task and being like reading the Bible more often. My counselor was Andrew Yoder and my cabin was Palomino Point and we basically as a group were able to come together as a family and we were all at the beginning we were a little bit strange like we were strangers to each other but at the end of the camp we were brothers in the cabin i saw god in many different ways um mostly wednesday night after ben our pastor for the week uh, was preaching we had a huge amount of time to talk to God and that really just hit all of the kids being able to focus and pray. What would I tell a friend about Camp Hebron? The most important thing to me would be growing with God and yourself, being able to know who you are and know who God is. Also, it's not only focusing on God, you are able to grow with the kids around you and being able to come close like a family. Also. <laughs> Uh, we have all these amazing trips during the week. And I plan to come back next year, definitely. This was like the best time of my year. 
and I would hope to come until they make me stop. <laughs> well, it's been a great week at camp. It's been wonderful having you here. And we're just so thrilled that the number of people who know and love camp, our many families, many people find camp to be holy ground. We thought we'd ask one of those families who have been involved for many years, if they'd just tell us why they love camp. Let's see what they say. In my role at camp, I've served as a camp pastor and a camp staff pastor, and I got to see young people grow up in the Lord and become the future leaders of America's church. Um, and now I'm in the role as a parent where I get to send my kids to camp. And uh, I know that they're going to be in good hands and that they're, they're going to be challenged in their faith and they're going to grow in their faith. And now with a daughter who is working on staff, I'm watching her grow. And I like swimming and I also like learning about Jesus. at camp three summers when I was a teen and those three summers were really transformational for me uh, because I got challenged in my own spiritual walk and I got to see that serving God was really a lot of fun. Uh, there can be a lot of adventure and, and laughter and joy in serving God and doing things for Him. I'm really, really happy um, uh, that so many people are willing to work so hard to make this camp as good as they can for us so that we can enjoy it very much. I'm really excited about going to camp this year because I'm doing discipleship camp and my sister went before me and she said there's a lot of adventure aspects and also spiritual adventure so I'm really excited to go this year. Um, what I love about camp is the staff. Um, even when I was a camper and even now that I'm on staff, um, I I uh, love their encouragement and all the happiness that they had. Um, I like um, uh, the gym class that because I get to hang out with my friends and Dan Canada has some really awesome games that we can play and it's really cool. Wow, wasn't that great? One of the things I really love about Camp Eber is it's so many things to so many people. But the thing we all have in common is we find holy ground in camp. We're so glad you were here with us this week. And we hope that you'll want to come back and, like the Hawk sets, be involved in a lot of different ways. You can come to more programs. You can invite others to come and enjoy the fun with you. We would love to have you give of your time and your talent as a volunteer and your treasure as you support things like the A-Frame Chapel that they were standing in front of, which came about through the generosity of people who know and love camp. So thanks again for being a part of this week with us. And we look forward to seeing you again at Camp Hebron, where people connect with God, nature, and each other.